Good day, good day, fellow vegans. We pray to you, giant melon. As a reminder, Alex built this. It, it's just proof of his conversion from the pumpkin religion to the melon religion. All right, speaking of great things Alex has built, you might have already seen this on his channel. Um, I, I don't know how I feel about him building things because it does kind of feel like cheating, but they're things that don't give me any advantage, so I, get, I guess it's good memes. Ah, so if we just go for a fly here. Yes, take a look at this. He's given us a bamboo forest. Let's go land up on the- Ow! Ow! I- I'm still getting good at flying, guys. He built a beautiful Chinese panda habitat. It's got a beautiful waterfall, a nice bridge. Uh, it's got like this little, this little house here. You know, a little panda house, a little panda temple. I'm just happy all my beautiful pandas can have a nice home. There's even fish in the river. These pandas were once tasked with a very difficult job. It's so nice to see them have a big, beautiful habitat. I hope you guys live a very big, happy life, guys. Let, let me feed him. Let me feed him real quick. You ready? Oh, feed the... Eat up, pandas. Come on, guys. Come on, have eat your food. Oh, look at them. They're all so happy now. Um, so you guys know the drill. We are trying to finish all the advancements in my Minecraft world. We need to get a trident. Um, so I'm going to get one today. But I have a very unconventional game-breaking method to get me a trident. I will be Poseidon, god of the oceans. But we have to break Minecraft to get it. So we're going to work on that. But firstly, we have a couple changes. Will it? King of the Andals and the First Men. Lord of D-Town. Um, I tried to make him an Iron Throne, like Game of Thrones. Y'all had a good comment. I should make it covered in iron swords. I'ma do that. Every- it's- it's rare. Like, it's a rare- What's going on, guys? It's a rare scenario, but occasionally you got- What's going on, guys? It's a rare scenario, but occasionally you guys have a good idea. I have the 19 item What's frames- What's going on, guys? There must be a zombie trap somewhere. Where? I'm trying to- I'm tr What's going on, guys? I'm trying to get to, like, closer to the source. What's going on, guys? What's going on, guys? What's oh, going this had on, to guys? be Alex, dude. <laughs> oh, my God. What's it say? Can't sleep, huh? It all makes sense now. All right, can we go back to making iron swords for Willy now? Um, what do I need for uh, iron swords, right? So, so I want to make 19, I guess. Khaleesi demands an iron throne. I serve at your will, Khaleesi. Yes, my dog is my beautiful Khaleesi. Where can I... I'll, I'll put iron, iron swords here. I can put, like, iron... There. It took Aegon the Conqueror many, many battles to get that many swords. Billion IQ Game of Thrones talk here. Yeah, that looks sick. Oh, shout out to my Iron Golem farm for making this a reality. You know, making this dream possible. Is this... Oh, man, Alex is just... He's building too many things. Like, might be a bit much now, Alex. You like jazz? You like jazz? You like jazz? You like jazz? That's a, a random beehive that I found while getting leather. Bro, this man is doing the dumbest things on this server. I... Okay, whatever. I'm not even gonna question it. Uh, I think I think that's oh fight. That took like two stacks of iron. <laughs> Your throne is complete, my Khaleesi. I hope you are proud of me. You must have servants. The great Willy must have servants. You are a servant of the great Willy, Lord of the D Town, mate. If Daenerys has a queen's guard. Uh, Willy needs an iron guard. Oh, that looks sick. He has two golems being his personal bodyguard protection. You guys know if you don't protect my dog, you go to the iron golem farm. I got a little sidetracked. I want to get a trident. To do it, you can build trident farms. I have like everything I need in this shulker box. The one thing I still need is turtles. I need turtle eggs for this farm. First of all, we need to find turtles. Turtle, there's a turtle right here. Yes, you are going to be Boris. You will be my first. You're going to be Boris. Yes, okay, I've got myself a turtle. All right, no big deal. I'm tucked in a turtle. Yes, mate, you are going to be my turtle. All I need you to do is lay some eggs. You wanna know a sad fact about Galapagos tortoises? Uh, when they discovered them, they used to keep trying to take them back to England, but they never got them back because they'd always eat them on the trip. They tasted too good. It's a fun little Wikipedia fact for you. This is this is a place we call Turtle Tortoise Cove. You've got a beautiful habitat here, mate. 
There's no reason to ever leave it. You never have to leave this place. Oh, hopefully he's still here. He is. What's up, mate? Boris the Turtle Tortoise. <laughs> Last time I saw you, it was 2017. Get him, Boris! Sick him! Sick him, Boris! All right, beautiful. Get ready to meet Boris. Boris, what? Where are you going? No, Boris! Bad, Boris. Get back in. You can try and fight me, Boris. You are going back in that water. I just got you a female. Apparently, Boris just he just wants to escape. I don't understand. All right, I'm going to lure him together with seagrass. You want this seagrass, Boris? You got to earn it, big boy. I was trying to get a trident with my big brain. This is, I should have just gone and done it the normal way. Come get some seagrass. Oh, this is, hopefully this is enough. Let's get him love making. Yes, love make. Yes. What are you doing? Love make. Two hours later. I read on Wikipedia, turtles will only lay eggs at their home beach. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna breed a couple random turtles. I'm gonna need you guys to breed, please. I'm gonna need you guys to breed. Take some, take some seagrass. Yes, breed for me, turtles. Yes. Please, go lay some eggs. Yes, he's ma he's laying eggs. Oh my god. I've never- It's nature, it's beautiful. No, it's okay, you can leave your eggs. I promise I'll look after them. Thank you. Thank you for the egg. I got a turtle egg, guys. Thank you. I forced her to give birth and then I immediately took the egg. That is one of the worst things I have ever done. But now we can build our farm. Our beautiful trident farm. Yeah, so in order to build my farm, I want to make a conduit. Like 18 episodes ago, I found a heart of the sea. And using some of these shells from AFK Fishing, uh, some Nautilus shells, we take all this into here and we can make... A conduit. A conduit means you can breathe underwater and you can mine way faster underwater. It's just going to make building the farm way easier. Okay, we got to go find ourselves a suitable spot for this little farm. Luckily for us, there is a massive ocean out here. Okay, I think I found a good spot for it. Oh, there's a drowned. Yes, this is a good sign. This means we're in the right area. Thank you. Yeah, this will work good. All right, so what we want is we want to build the conduit. So it's like a nether portal, but not a nether portal. We need to break this glass, or we gonna drown. If we don't break this glass, we drown. Boof, there we go. We have a conduit. I'm going to put my shulker box down, and we can now begin our trident farm. Under the sea, under the sea. Under the sea. I can now be under here forever and live my dream of being a mermaid. Ah, oh, man. I'm actually following the guide of, like, a literal 12-year-old. So, I mean, he seems like a big big brain 12-year-old. So, I'm going to trust him. Okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do, even before building the farm, is finding a flat location. I think it's coming along nicely. This kid is actually, actually makes sick tutorials. He's very clear and concise. Uh, I'll see you when it's done. None of you want to watch this crap. Eventually. All right, so the farm should be done. This should be completely finished. So it sends the drowned to the nether, which is a bit scuffed because it sends me sends them to my actual nether portal. So every time I go to the nether, I'm going to run into a bunch of drowned. Ah, uh, the turtle eggs are to lure the drowned in to the nether. We're sacrificing the eggs. <laughs> Just got to destroy the conduit, set up an AFK area. And the drowned should be spawning. Thank you for your hard work, Conduit. Thank you. All right, I'm hoping the drowned will start spawning now. Uh, I got to build an AFK area. Roughly 114 blocks in the sky. I'm almost there. I think I'm at the exact height. Okay, make myself a little platform uh, to sit AFK in. Now let's see if my big brain strategy has paid off. This is the dumbest way to get a chart. <laughs> 20 minutes later. Oh, can you hear it? Can you hear it? Can you hear it? Yeah, there's a couple drowned in there. Let's see if any of them got a trident. Let's slice and dice them. Not only do we have the chance of getting a trident, we also get a whole ton of experience. No tridents, guys. No tridents. This is... All right, back to AFK. We get experience, we get tridents. Tomorrow. Um, it's the next morning. I AFK'd overnight. You wait till you see how many drowned there are, but... 
looked disaster struck. I managed to die while I wasn't recording and it's it's in the definition of an unrecoverable situation. It just basically means I've lost absolutely everything. I mean, I've got backups for most items. I can't get my Elytra back. I'm not showing my face cam so you can't see my absolute tears. The one advantage we have is the absolute insane amount of drowned we got. Man, this trident better be worth it. I've lost a lot. Gimme trident. Please. I need this. I need this. I need something good to come from this. Oh. My god. Did I get a try? Oh, yeah. Now, the advancement says I have to throw a trident at something. Yeah, I need to get all the experience I can. Now, this farm would have worked a whole lot better if I didn't die. So you can get infinite tridents from this, but I died. So, it's a little bit awkward. Oh, but I have the trident. I have it. What enchantments can I get on this thing? Maybe I try enchanting it first with levels. Basically, Alex was trying to do a meme and it went bad and neither of us were recording, so I'm heartbroken, but it's okay. No stress. I just, I don't have my silk touch axe anymore. So it's way harder to get melons for emeralds. I'm just gonna get a bunch of emeralds, get to level 30 from selling stuff and then enchant this trident. The only thing I can't replace is that Elytra? I'm heartbroken. What's up, dudes? I got some melons to sell. Well, I sold enough melons to get to level 30. And I also have racks of emeralds. Yeah, let's enchant this trident. What do I get on it? Oh my, we got it. We got exactly what we needed. We needed channeling. Yeah, I'm very sad because I lost everything. But I got the perfect trident after everything. Why couldn't I have just got a trident the normal way? Why'd I have to do it the dumb way? All right, we got to go do something real quick. I gotta go buy mending for this, uh, for this trident. Yes, give me mending. Thank you very much. Yep, let's just slap mending on this bad boy. Easy done. Um, yeet. Fork. Ready? I can throw it at stuff. Huh. Yeah, and it comes back to me. <laughs> the thumbnail is going to have multiple tridents because... I can get multiple tridents. It's just I die. You're the one that I'm sacrificing for my achievement. Ah! <laughs> a throwaway joke. Yeah. Yeah, was that achievement worth all the sacrifice? <laughs> Finally, it's raining. I waited like two days for this. All right, quick, let's use my electric fork. <laughs> yes, my electric yeet, yeet fork. Ah, there's, I created a witch. I did not mean to create a witch. I'll kill that witch later. I don't really care. I got my two achievements. We looking good, boys. I sacrificed a lot for this super-powered yeet fork. All right, well, I'm one sad beamy boy. But we finally got the trident in the dumbest way possible. What? 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 What?